Cappy, something just happened to you. You had a friend. She's moved because I had to change my socks. I didn't have the right shoes, so I have these shoes that we just got from the Nike store. We didn't have the right socks. And you took your bare foot out in public. I just ate my foot out, which is disgusting. The lady here, she endured it for 80% of the procedure. And then she left. You disgusted her. I did. Welcome to the Portland Live Workout. So excited to be here tonight with our incredible ReFit crew. Let's go meet some of these people. Come on. Am I on the video? Hey, everybody. Hi. Fifi. Hi. Oh, hi. Hello. Oh, what I'm doing? Tell me, like, one thing that you love about ReFit. Everything. The community. The law of in it. That's from the tribe. The tribe. I'm with them. The community, the family. <laughs> Brenda is our host here tonight in Oregon. Brenda, how long have you been a refit instructor for? 10 years. She makes this class so much fun. That's why we all come. All of us come because of Brenda. She's wonderful. How long have you been a refit instructor for? 2021. So it'll be three years. And what made you want to become a refit instructor? I really liked it and I felt like I could do a workout and be a community with other people that were able-bodied and not feel like excluded from it. Are you so excited for tonight? Yeah. And tell me, what's your name? I'm, I'm Zara. Tell me your name. I'm Abigail. And I'm... 19. You're 19. Are you are y'all excited to do refit tonight? Yes. yes. I'm a rapper. A rapper. Can, do you want to rap right now? Yeah. All right, let's go. Okay. Here, we go. Here we go. I'm sure I'm gonna pick it. I'm gonna rap for because this goes by me. This goes by me. I got some money here. Because I'm the raised rap. But I'm done. This is my flow. I'm just some super. There you go. Hey, good job. It truly is inclusive. I always tell people that other formats that I've taught are all about how to make a rock star instructor. Am I supposed to look at this or look at you? <laughs> you look wherever you want, Brenda. I don't know. It's so exciting every time I see like this connection with you know people around the community. It's just it's just so much enjoy it. But refit teaches us how to make people feel like rock stars, like us and everybody that shows up, and that. That makes me teary, just the thought of it, because people are hungry for that. I prayed for these women to come into my life, and I came here, and here they were, so I'm thankful. Let's go. We love it. Yes, yes, yes. Our handler says we have to go to the green room and take five minutes and then come back. Okay, five minutes. I might get, might do a run and gun interview in the next five minutes. So, hi, Mia. A lot of times, the green room is not green, but in this case, there is a green door. Yeah, so Liz, who's actually filming right now, outfitted the green room with a little Burt, little Burt Reynolds, and then <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> nothing, nothing but Burt and Jeff. It, do you have anything to say to the people at home? No. Here at the Portland Refit Instructor Training, but one of the cool things about this facility is this is where one of our instructors actually teaches her refit and rev and flow classes. So we're gonna go check out Brenda's rev and flow classes happening right outside these doors. Let's go see it in action. I'm Michelle, I'm from Sherwood, and um, I've been dancing for nine years, like Zumba, but I just started refit this last year. Hi, I'm Kristen. I found refit probably just like the end of November. I love it and I decided to become instructor actually last night. I want to become an instructor because I love taking Brenda's class and I want people to have a place where they can unplug and sweat and have fun. Honestly, it was just different and unique and really special. So much energy and so warm and welcoming and loving and everybody was um, just very inclusive. When I walked into the room, everybody knew your name and they were so glad you came and it was just this really wonderful, supportive community feeling. I want to be able to share that with with my group of people in my area. And it was at a time I really needed it because I had gone some, through some hard things and you know COVID and everything and it was just really needed. It was just really unique and special and I loved it and so I totally on board with continuing to bring community together and have a place to de-stress and everything that we're dealing with leave it out the door and just having fun and also yeah just building that sense of community.